All right, cut it out. Time to get up. But what's the problem? Didn't you get hours and hours of sleep and feel completely rejuvenated? No? You spread yourself so thin that sleep really does fall behind. Why is sleep important? Let's put it this way. You work the whole day. Your brain is exhausted. It needs to rejuvenate. Think of sleep as the ultimate way to recharge your brain. It's super important for development. You can become anxious, depressed, you can have memory issues, you can have behavioral problems, you can have aggression. A lot of things are possible when you don't sleep. Teens are supposed to get eight to 10 hours of sleep a day, but the average teen only gets around seven hours. A good night's sleep can help concentration, memory, mood, and health. My alarm would go off super loud. I smack the alarm. I would roll around in my bed, throw the covers, and sluggishly get up, and then somehow throw my clothes and go to school. And then the day would go. That was last year. But this year, Brian Wedderburn's school pushed back its start time from 8 to 8.30. And that extra half hour makes a big difference. How has your routine changed with the late school start time? It's the same usually get out of bed, but I'm not as grumpy as I used to be. I'm smiling, I'm not stressed at all, like I'm functioning way better than before. And I just grab my stuff, go in the shower, and I come out and I'm usually just ready to start the day. I'm happy to go to school. That's why the American Academy of Pediatrics and other medical associations have been pushing for schools to start later, at least 8.30. It's clear that this is what kids need to function at their best, to learn at their best. So you can ignore it or you can engage it and try to do what's best for kids. Now, if sleep is so important, why aren't teens getting enough of it? Well, get this, teens are actually programmed to stay up later and sleep in. Normal people sleep at, let's say, 10, 11 o'clock and wake up at 7 o'clock. Teenagers, as they go into their teen years, start sleeping later and later. And obviously, they have to wake up on time, so if they sleep at 2 o'clock and wake up at 7 o'clock, they've only had five hours of sleep. There's actually a sun up most days when I get up now, and I actually want to get out of bed. Just 30 minutes of sleep makes it so that I can focus on the classes that I have to pay attention to. And feeling more rested improves just about every aspect of the school day. Late start schools have seen a jump in test scores and a decrease in tardiness, stress levels, and behavior problems. Students are much more alert. They're able to focus on the academic curriculum much better. So the overall experience has been very positive. Another reason teens are sleep deprived, technology. Using social media or surfing the web right before bed can keep that brain of yours working much longer than it needs to. That's because the blue light from your technology mimics daylight. And the blue light from an iPad is extremely alerting. It goes into the brain and tells the biological clock, stay awake. And your diet also plays a big role in your sleep. Coffee has become the regular breakfast. You so don't need food, you just need a coffee and you're good to go. You need that caffeine. A lack of sleep makes the body crave sugar and caffeine, but that ends up keeping you up all night since caffeine stays in your system for several hours afterwards. Then you wake up late, skipping the most important meal of the day. In order to compensate for the lack of sleep that we get, we cut into our breakfast time, so then we just wake up extremely late and then just run to school. We don't even have time to eat breakfast. Now, this might sound like a lot to take in, but don't even worry. Just sleep on it. Sleep is a necessity. You need it. Ariel Hickson, Channel One News.